Happy Tuesday, FHS. I'm Hannah. And I'm Sarah with your morning news. We hope you had a great time at prom. It seems that several Cinderella's left the ball without their glass slippers. If any of these are yours, please stop by Mrs. Steffi's room to pick them up. Testing out forms are now available for students wanting to test out of a course for next year. Forms can be found on the FHS webpage under News. Please complete the form and return it to Mr. Deeroff by today, May 17, 2022, to participate in testing out this summer. Attention any 9th, 10th, or 11th grade boys that are interested in playing basketball this winter. There will be a brief in informational meeting on Wednesday, 518, right after school in Coach Jonas's room, D103. We will be going over summer schedules and expe expectations. The meeting will take no more than 15 minutes, but if you can't make it, you'll need to see Coach Jonas Thursday or Friday. Seniors, on May 19th during 5th and 6th hour, Glad TV will be filming for the senior video. This year will be a lip dub. All seniors are invited to participate in this fun event. Section leaders have been chosen. Please make sure to learn your song and bring your spirit wear on Thursday. New job opportunities have recently been posted on the Career Pathways website. If you are graduating this year or are looking for summertime work, please be sure to check the homepage of the Career Pathways website for current job opportunities. Please see Mrs. Lusk with any questions. The class of 2024 will be selling Sour Punch straws every Thursday right after school. Sour Punch straws will be sold one for $2 or three for five in the ha hallway outside the main office. Make sure to get yours this Thursday. In sports, the JV softball team continued its winning streak, taking two games from Okemos. Game one was 15-0 win in three innings. Grace Nelson held, led from the mound, striking out eight Okemos batters. Tara Patterson anchored the offense, hitting two for three with a double and triple, along with four RBIs. Lily Hall, Maggie Burma, and Molly Lamar each added two hits to secure the win. Game two was a 14-2 win in five innings. Meadow Brown earned the victory, striking out eight. Burma and Lamar's bats remained hot, racking up two hits each. Brown and Audrey Felver were each 2-for-2 two two at the plate to help sweep Okemos. The varsity softball team went 1-for-1 one one against Mason last night. The girls play again for the league title tonight against Lansing Eastern. Good luck, ladies. The varsity tennis team won 7-1 against Owasso last night. The girls compete in regionals on Thursday. Good luck, ladies. Soccer also took home a win last night. The JV team won 8-0 and varsity won 9-3 against Ionia. The girls play Wednesday night at Charlotte. That's all we have for you today. I'm Hannah. And I'm Sarah. Signing, signing off. off.